Hi everybody, Paul back here again from Ballistic Blood Bullets and delighted to be here today with one of the all-time classic long-running big screen movie series from Japan and a real, real delight and treasure that this complete series has been finally released to Blu-ray and to DVD and it is, of course, the legend that is Zatoichi, the blind swordsman, and here is one of the film episodes from the series, and this is Zatoichi versus the one-armed swordsman, or meets the one-armed swordsman, but it is all about Zatoichi, and this release, fantastic release, from Criterion, the beautiful beautiful box set of all the movies released from the 60s into the 70s of Satoichi. Absolutely, absolutely thrilled to bits with this one. Let's just have a look around the magnificent box set itself and the exterior pictures but just display the wonderful, wonderful artwork of this magnificent Japanese cultural cinematic experience. It really is absolutely amazing that this has finally been properly released by the magnificence of Criterion. The movies themselves have been individually released, of course, over the years but uh, with varying degrees of quality, not always in the right aspect ratio. This Criterion set absolutely addresses all of those inconsistencies and really delivers to the fans of Japanese samurai cinema just what this has been crying out for, an absolute absolute real real treasure of a set and it does also come complete with a wonderful wonderful book which is a hardback edition and again fabulous looking artwork repletes the front of this and it's almost like uh, a media book in itself. There's no DVDs or videos inside this book. This is purely a book of some volume and weight to it and uh, absolutely brilliant and it does tell the tale of Zatoichi and all of the individual stories that uh, complement the movies and we'll have a look at that again in a little while but uh, let's just open up the wonderfulness of this box set and have a look inside and all of the glorious Zatoichi goodness and uh, what a chunky chunky set this is as hopefully the camera is picking up here it really is quite an incredible feast for the eyes not only visually for the movies but also the splendor with which Criterion have put their efforts into making this not only a complete set of movies but a real, real treasure to behold. Just have a look around the magnificence of this DVD and Blu ray container set and some glorious, glorious artwork there. It really is just a pleasure for the eyes. Absolutely wonderful, wonderful stuff. And uh, inside what we get is a cacophony of discs that scream out at us in their casings. And uh, they do individually get shown here all the details pertaining to all of the movies and there are 26 original big screen movies featuring the original star 
who is of course the legendary Shintaro Katsu who plays the blind swordsman throughout this original run of series movies for the big screen and uh, all of these discs are nicely housed and uh, as I say there is a blu-ray and also a DVD for each of these movies so it does cater for everybody who would wish to be able to witness these movies for the first time or go back and revisit them in all the glory of HD but also if uh, they're not yet fortunate enough to have a Blu-ray player they are also available here complete, unabridged, unadulterated in DVD as well and uh, this entire book container does open up throughout its entirety here right through to the back of the book exactly as we are looking at right now so all of these pages do show not only the movies themselves but also the casings for the discs which nested in very nicely they've done a very very good job here and uh, it is a sturdy container nice hardback feel to the casing itself and uh, of course the containing outer slip hard box container of this as well is absolutely wonderful wonderful stuff Criterion have done an excellent excellent job really is absolutely fantastic no question about it if uh, you're considering buying this one I think that uh, definitely at the moment of time to get it because I purchased mine from Barnes & Noble and of course it was during their 50% off period and uh, this one retails for about $200 and I managed to pick it up for about 125 which converting to English money including shipping worked out at about £76 now if I had all this before the discount was applied or in fact later I'm sure it will go up again this would have not been £75, £76 uh, it would have cost about £125, £130 so that is one hell of a saving and what a package so great time to get in on Zatoichi now just uh, talk a little bit about uh, the series of course Zatoichi is the movie Legendary Adventures of a Japanese Master Swordsman who also just so happens to be blind. Starring Shintaro Katsu who plays the lead role of Zatoichi in an incredible 26 big screen movies spanning between The Tale of Zatoichi made back in 1962 and Zatoichi the Blind Swordsman in 1989 that is just phenomenal and uh, the 1989 film was called Zatoichi the Blind Swordsman which was his return to the cinematic role for his swan song appearance in the lead role of Zatoichi since the film series finale the original film series finale in 1973 with Zatoichi's Conspiracy. Now, Shintaro Katsu did return to the role for the small screen TV series as well in 1976, which itself ran for an incredible 46 episodes through until 1979. Shintaro Katsu was also a very competent director and producer, directing Zatoichi in Desperation from the original movie series back in 1972 and along with also 11 episodes of the TV show and finally what I think is quite apt in fact he directed proceedings as well as starring for the final time in the 1989 conclusion to his self-defining role as Zatoichi now for me one of the great highlights from the movie series is the 1971 movie Zatoichi meets the one-armed swordsman which is Japanese samurai versus Chinese master swordsman 
and Shaw Brothers legend Jimmy Wang Yu. Now this movie has uh, at least two different endings and purported to have three. Now the version that is shown here is the original Japanese release, which I won't spoil the ending, but it's fair to say that uh, the Chinese version is an adaption which shows Jimmy Wang Yu's character walking away as the winner. And there is also an alternate cut that apparently shows neither the blind swordsman Zatoichi or Jimmy Wang Yu's one-armed swordsman winning. They both end on a draw, so to speak. But this is the Japanese cut of the movie that's shown in this series from Criterion and is apparently the only surviving edition of the movie, which is a shame because it would have been fantastic to have been able to have found at least the Jimmy Wang Yu version ending to go as a bonus extra, if not both, and to have all three versions would have been absolutely fantastic. But there we are. Uh, never mind, we've, we've got the original Japanese version, which considering this is the tale of Zatoichi, is perhaps the most pertinent and relevant one to have for this classic series. Now, just to uh, say a little bit more as well about star Shintaro Katsu. He appeared as another cinematic Japanese samurai warrior legend in a series during the 70s. He was Hanzo the Razor, and I highly recommend checking out that series of movies as well. He started three of these movies, and they were made between 1972 and 1974. Classic, classic stuff. Now let's just, again, I can't get enough of this beautiful Japanese artwork, absolutely fantastic. Let's just have a quick look at the hardback book as well. It really does detail each episode from the movie series and uh, giving us information pertaining to production notes about the making and about the transfer of the movies for Criterion but also then goes into depth about some of the behind the scenes and making of the original productions of these films in the tale of Zatoichi there and uh, then it does go on to look individually at each movie and give us some background information a little bit of storyline just to complement the series and we've got that great anime style Japanese artwork there as well which is a theme throughout this wonderful hardback edition booklet great great stuff absolutely great value for money with this Barnes & Noble 50% off and other deals that can be acquired at this time so now is definitely definitely the time for fans and uh, not only of Zatoichi, but uh, those who love samurai movies, Japanese films, and uh, all action samurai, swordsmanship, martial arts, absolutely stunning, stunning stuff, all highly complemented by Criterion's great experience in producing the goods for these wonderful old school classic movies. So that's a, a quick look through at the artwork and uh, story and also synopsis of each movie of Zatoichi in this wonderful complimenting book. And uh, there we have it all together there. We have the casings for the movies and also the outer hard card retaining sleeve. Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Absolutely thrilled with this and can't wait to Start from the beginning with the Zatoichi movies and uh, really just dive on in there. And certainly, this cannot be considered to be a blind buy, it is definitely an intentional purchase. And uh, Zatoichi, the blind swordsman, looking forward to checking out every single movie. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. And uh, hats off to Shintaro Katsu for delivering one of the iconic characters from Japanese cinema. Wonderful stuff. Let me know if you have picked up this box set, if you intend to, if you've watched the movies, 
what uh, your favourite movies are, what your favourite uh, moments are from the films. Look forward to hearing what your thoughts and views are on this. And uh, thank you very much indeed for watching. Really appreciate your time and staying with me on this a little bit longer than usual video. But uh, this is a great, great series released from Criterion that deserved that extra bit of attention and detail. Thanks for watching everybody. Take care. See you all soon. Bye for now.